Manchester United have made a change to their matchday plans for their game against Brentford. Eric Ten Hag's side will continue their hunt for a Champions League place on Saturday night when they travel to the capital to take on Thomas Frank's strugglers. They are currently nine points off Aston Villa in fourth with ten games left to play, though trail Tottenham in fifth by six points, with fifth potentially enough to mix it with Europe's elite next season. The Red Devils will be heavily back to pick up three points on Saturday, with Brentford currently 15th and struggling with injuries as they find themselves getting dragged into a relegation battle. The club, however, have made an unusual adaption to their matchday plans as they prepare to get back into action after the international break. United will reportedly travel to the game on the day of the match, rather than the day before, as usual, due to the scheduled kickoff time. The game is set to kick off at 8 p.m. Greenwich Mean Time, with Sky Sports set to show the fixture live in a blockbuster day of Premier League action. Some of the team were pictured at Manchester Airport on Saturday morning as they prepared to travel south. Saturday will see eight games played in the top flight, with Newcastle vs West Ham kicking off proceedings in the lunchtime kickoff ahead of five 3 p.m. games. Aston Villa will then host Wolves at 5.30 p.m., before an additional fixture, United's clash with Brentford, take place in the evening. United's decision to travel on the day of the game comes due to the kickoff time, meaning there will be plenty of time for them to travel before they need to be at the Gatet Community Stadium. It is the fourth time this season United have had a game moved to 8 p.m. on a Saturday, the most of any team in the Premier League, and all of them have been away from home following visits to Newcastle, Sheffield United and Burnley. It has also been reported that the delayed departure will give some of their key stars extra recovery time regarding illness and injury, including Kavi Mainu. Mainu starred for England as he made his international debut over the last fortnight, but missed training on Thursday as he struggled with illness upon his return to club duty. Eric Ten Hag said on Friday of his teenage star, yesterday he skipped training because he was ill. I don't know if he will be fit. We hope. Today he is there, not fully recovered but we still have many hours before tomorrow with kickoff at 8 p.m. The likes of Johnny Evans will also face late fitness tests ahead of the game. Brentford, meanwhile, will remain without the likes of Ben Mee and Ethan Pinnock as their injury troubles continue to mount. Brian Mbumo, however, is expected to play some part, as will Ivan Tony on the back of scoring for England against Belgium on Tuesday. Dear listener, please follow and subscribe to our lovely channel for more updates. Thanks.